お願いします。Hello, I'm Lu Sensei from Ninja Abbey Nin Martial Arts, and today I'm going to be going over、uh, Senban Shuriken throwing.、Uh, and these are drills that you can do if you have a dojo, or you, know, you can do outside your house, you can do、uh, you know, maybe at a playground or in the woods, or even like inside your basement. okay? So you don't need、uh, a shuriken board like this. You can use a big、uh, cut of styrofoam. You can go to、uh, Home Depot or Lowe's and grab yourself you know, a, a big uh, uh, wooden board.、Uh, you want like a soft type of wood、um, you know, so that the shuriken actually sticks on,、uh, on, on the,、uh, the board itself.、Okay? You can use cardboard, things like that. So,、uh, Senban shuriken. Uh, look like this.、Uh, there's many different kinds of Senban Shuriken, okay? And Senban Shuriken just means、uh, the star type of Shuriken, okay? So,、uh, as far as Senban Shuriken is concerned,、uh, there's many different styles. This is Togakere Ru、uh, Senban Shuriken.、Uh, so, Togakere Ru、uh, Ninja would use this type of Shuriken.、Uh, originally, these were not used as weapons, they were actually tools,、uh, they were nail pullers. Okay, so the ninja or samurai would use a lot of the tools they would use for farming as their weapons, okay, because they really didn't have much else、uh, to use. Uh, so uh, ninja would always carry nine senban shuriken on them. So、uh, just keep that in mind.、Um, also, if you're going to practice this at home,、uh, you do not want、uh, to get shuriken、uh, from online. Uh, per se, 90% of the shuriken that are available online are, I'm going to be completely honest with you, they are crap.、Um, they're not the right size or the right weight.、Uh, some of them are sharp、uh, around the edges, which is no good for the type of throwing that we do、uh, here at the school.、Um, they're just complete crap. They're junk. You know, they're cheap.、Um, they'll break easily.、Uh, if you want to set a shuriken, Let us know and we can get you some. We get ours directly from Japan from somebody that's been studying our same martial art for over 40 years. Okay, they, too, they do take a little while to come in, usually about two to three weeks, but they are way worth it.、Um, you get for what you pay for, for sure.、Um, and you definitely don't want to be throwing the incorrect type of shuriken. Okay, so with that being said,、uh, I'm going to go over you know, how to throw properly、um, the shuriken. Okay, So you want to make sure, and I'm standing close to the board so you guys can see me,、um, but you want to make sure you are kind of close. This is a little too close.、Uh, maybe you want to be you know, kind of like right here、uh, to start.、Uh, you want to get accuracy first before you work on distance. Okay, So I'm just standing right here so you guys can see me.、Uh, if you're right handed, That means your right leg and your right arm is going to lead, right? It's going to be like this.、Uh, if you're left handed, obviously you'll be in the opposite direction. Okay? So、uh, when you throw, you're going to put uh, your three, uh, your pinky, your ring finger, and your middle finger underneath the shuriken. Index finger goes on the side, like so. And thumb goes on top, just like that. Okay? And when you throw, You're going to point to where you throw. okay? So I see a lot of beginners,、uh, when they go to throw, they, they're all wild and they you know, go like this. Well, then the shuriken goes flying that way or that way. okay? If you're pointing to where you're throwing, it'll go right where you point it. okay? So also, you want to you wanna get a little rhythm okay? when you throw. So I sway a little bit, and when I sway forward, That's when I throw, okay? And you want to make sure there's a nice grouping at whatever you're aiming for, okay? So, say I'm aiming for this top shuriken right here. I want to make sure I'm hitting pretty much the same spot each time, okay? So, you want to make sure you're hitting the same spot each time. Also, it does not matter at first if you're not getting the shuriken stuck on your board or whatever you're using.、Uh, 
what matters the most is that you're hitting, uh, you're being accurate. You're hitting the same spot, okay? Um, that's what matters most. See, um, movies, um, you know, pretty much lie to you. Your, uh, your famous ninja movies, you see a ninja, he's throwing a shuriken, and it hits the guy in the head, and then the guy, you know, dies or whatever. That doesn't really happen. These were a distraction tool, okay? So say uh, I was faced against you know, multiple people, say like three or four samurai, I might pull out my shuriken to try to throw some at their face, get them distracted so I can run off to safety, okay? These are not used to kill. They're not a killing weapon. They're, they're a distraction tool, okay? Um, also, you wanna be careful when you're throwing, keep your hand completely flat, all right? Um, I see a lot of beginners, they'll throw the shuriken and it'll end up kind of crook it like this, you know, in a 45 degree or up and down, okay? If your shuriken ends up that way in a 45 degree or up and down, that means your hand was not completely sideways when you're throwing. See how my shuriken is nice and flat? That's exactly how you want it, okay? There are different uh, types of throws uh, for the shuriken and different uh, kamai, different stances. Uh, but I will go over that in more detail during a seminar or a class. I got to go to my stuff.